kind of comfort, I don't want to say closure, but what kind of comfort would that title have given have given you in your time of grief? Um, uh, absolutely a tremendous amount. You know, we um, I was just talking about that uh, um, probably half an hour ago. You know, I think um, having the marriage recognized on the death certificate, you know, it's a... Uh, you have a chance to rewrite your own story in a way, right? Um, and so uh, I, I think that it, um, you know, I'm incredibly excited to be part of this lawsuit, and um, that's the reason why. I, I think it I think it gives me a, a different ending to a very long struggle that, that I can be proud of. When you lost your spouse, it's overwhelming to begin with, but it sounds like what happened after that was just, made it worse. I mean, you talked about it was the funeral home. <coughs> Why is that? I mean, what happened? Um, yeah, absolutely. It, it, it made it worse. It, it made it um, much more difficult. You know, 12 hours, 12, 14 hours after Pam died, I was in the funeral home. Um, uh, and being told that, you know, it was not an option to have um, the marriage recognized on her, her death certificate. And, um, you know, that, that was a long struggle. Um, I was her full-time caregiver for many months and um, to have that as um, kind of the final act you know kind of, kind of wrapping everything up um, with her life was absolutely tremendously hard um, I think it's um, you know an unnecessary struggle that that no one should have to face um, and that that brings me here today you know I, I figured the best way I can um, honor her life and, and the love we have is or had is, is to um, stand up so that's what I'm